Hello guys, I'm back with another build update. This is the Simple Arctic build. I had to update it today because of the um, the EIM, the Extended Info Mod, is not working. Apparently, it stopped this morning, so I have to update my builds. And um, I still left some parts of it on here as a placeholder just in case it starts working again. It'll be an easy fix for me to put it back in. And um, yeah, let me, it's nothing much changed in here. You know, I changed the backgrounds. I added some new ones. And um, I tweaked it up a little bit. So let me make this a short video and show you real quick. Like I said, it's an update to the Simple Arctic build. This is on um, version 4. Right here we have our, our video section, the files to navigate to your files if you want to add movies or shows to your um, <clears throat> to your build. So you can navigate through it through your files. You have your video add-ons. The same amount of add-ons is in here. Try to keep the build a little light, they didn't want it too heavy so I left those in there I didn't add any more of those here you have the hub you still have your TV box sets and your Wolfpack box sets and um the movie box sets like I said I left that there just in case the metallic and the extended info, info mod start working again and here we have our movie section here's the most popular Alright, in the sub menu we have Exodus movies, Flixneck movies, Dandy movies, Reborn movies, Bubble movies, Showbox movies, Skynet movies, Spectre movies, Salts movies, Real movies, At the Flix movies, Stream Army movies. Alright, so when you click in movies itself, it takes you to the Elysium add on in the movie category. Next we have our TV shows. For the widget on top we have most popular TV shows. Alright, in the sub menu we have Exodus TV shows, Dandy TV shows, Flixnet TV shows, Reborn TV shows, Bubble shows, Showbox TV shows, Specto TV shows, Sauce TV shows, Wolfpack TV shows, Falcon TV shows, Stream Army TV shows. Alright, when you click in TV show itself, it takes you to the Elysium TV show category. Alright, so everything is right here for your movies and your TV shows, right on your fingertips. You don't have to navigate to different add-ons to look for shows. You can either go to the sub-menu by pressing down and go straight to the to me, these are the most used add-ons, I guess. Alright, so next we have our 4K 3D section. In the sub-menu, we have Real Movies 3D, Stream Army 3D, Maverick 4K, Stream Army 4K, Falcon 4K, Wolfpack 4K. Oh, and Real Movies 4K on the top. Alright. So um, next we have our music section. As always, is your music video. All right. Sub menu you have your U Music, Django, Karma, Top 40 charts, and like I said, I left. You can see the metallic here, but <clears throat> nothing's gonna happen when you press on it. Like I said, I left that there just in case the, uh, it starts working again. You have your sports section. This is your ESPN3 Sports. In the sub menu, you have your Sky Sports Channel and your BT Sports Channel. You have your weather information if you want your weather on your home menu screen. This is how it looks. Like I said, I changed the backgrounds and everything. 
Here you have your program section. Take you straight to your programs. If I haven't showed you already how the thumbnail cleaner works, you hit your context button or long press button for this menu to pop up. Go to your settings. You slide over to select destination folder. So what you do is you'll navigate off of your Kodi folder to your external device. You know, to um so that way when you clean your thumbnails, it'll go off for your Kodi folder. So your Kodi one your Kodi folder one populate with thumbnails. And you can always delete it later. Okay, so once you navigate to the external device or whatever, you scroll down and then hit OK. Okay, you can click on it. Let me show you how it works. You'll slide down and go up to clean. Slide over to proceed. Like I said, guys, I'm moving. I'll be moving real quick. Just want to show you real quick. You hit OK. As you can see, the before and after. Before there was 319 files. Now it's 89 files. And you can see the size difference. Okay, you hit exit. And that's it. Later on, you could go to wherever you stored the thumbnails at and delete them. Alright. And here you have your settings and your power menu. So, those, this is for those that's new. If you know how to install it already, but for those that are new to the channel, you would you know be on a fresh uh, fresh Kodi and you go to your file manager and then add source and the source that you'll put in is right here is for the Aries wizard all right so that's the source you'll put in I will named it Aries you can name it whatever you want I've named it Aries and after you named it you hit OK then you would back out. Then now you would go to install from zip file. Okay. Once you get to install from zip file, you would go to Aries, because I named it Aries. You would go to whatever you named it. I named it Aries, so that's what it is. And you click on it and install it. I already have that installed, so you'll see a notification saying that it's installed then you would back out and go to install from repository scroll down to Aries project and program add-ons and you install this alright so after it's installed now you would want to go to your program section And you'll look for the Aries wizard. You'll go in there. You give it a few seconds to pop up. And guys, the next build I'll be updating is the um the black the black glass build. You know, and I thank you guys for being patient with me. You know, I'm updating these builds by myself. It's not like I have a team. Alright, so now you'll scroll down to Steven. So you're looking for Steven. It's right here. Okay. And you could tell it's Steven by the suit and the red tie. So once you see that, you click on it. And then you would scroll down to the simple Arctic. All right. I'm just waiting for the background to pop up so I can show you guys. So that way, when you look for it, you know um, which one it is. There we go. Okay. So once you do that, you click on it. As you can see, it's version 4.0. 
And like I said, be on a fresh, a fresh um Cody. If you haven't done so, you could go straight here and fresh start. And once you finish doing a fresh start, you would go to more. That's if your Cody didn't close by itself. You'll go to more and then force close. And then go back into Aries Wizard. And you browse builds. Scroll to Steven. Then go install. Yeah, simple Arctic and then install. Alright, and then you hit proceed. I already have it installed, so I'm going to stop in a few. I just wanted to show you it's 246 megabytes. Let me cancel it. Alright, I've updated the. Just in case you didn't know, I already updated the Cinema build. And it's all now version 2.0. Okay, so the next build will be the black glass build for those that's um, running the black glass build. I'll be updating this so it'll be up probably in the morning. I'll let you guys know probably in the morning or in the afternoon. And um, once again, thank you guys for being patient. If you're new to the channels, please subscribe. And um, thank you guys for watching.